there's a lot of stuff going on in the news about those um, pat downs at the airport. If you get a pat down, or they put you through the scan machine. I, don't, I really don't know why it's just making the news now, because last month I took a trip to Louisiana, Baton Rouge Airport, but in LAX they didn't have the scanner machines. So they made me do the pat down. It's not a pat down. It's a rub down. It's actually like um, somebody give me a massage without the oil. And being that it was same sex, it wasn't quite so enjoyable. But that's what they do now. And I mean, what can you do? I didn't like it. I would have took the um, scanner machine, quite frankly, but I didn't have the option. And I wasn't worried about my so-called digitally nude pictures showing because nobody wants to see a digitally nude guy anyway. Nobody. The last time I did a taping, um, I had asked about Lil Tyrone. And people actually thought I was making Lil Tyrone up. No. I saw one little reference to him in the internet. It was a Billboard magazine article, I guess 1970. I'm telling you, this guy was about Michael Jackson's age. He was on TV quite a bit during the time, just like Michael Jackson, but he didn't have Joe Jackson or Motown to back him up, and we forgot about him. He was on stuff like Bird Griffin Show, Della Reese Show. He was making the rounds, and we all forgot about him. No, I am not making up Lil Tyrone. I'm still in need of a co-host. Uh, I'm not begging for a co-host, but it would be nice to have a co-host, somebody kind of work with me on stuff like this, and it'll be fun. So if you're a guy in the L.A. area, you got lots of free time within reason, and uh, you know how to talk decently, why don't you hook me up and let me hook you up, and we can do this together. Just let me know something. I need a co-host.